Good morning, my name is Federico Anselmi and welcome back to Frau Facility. What we are going to briefly describe today is a complete plant for the production of the feta cheese. This plant is a peculiar solution because it works in complete automatic mode and it's connected with two possible final packaging solutions. What we will do at the beginning is two different formats. So we will do one liter format at 6,000 pieces per hour and 200 millimeters format in 5,000 pieces per hour. Let's get in detail in the process. The first part of the process is the receiving section. The receiving section is able to treat milk in liquid form or in some cases to reconstruct milk from milk powder. Uh, it's very important because uh, we can have both uh, situations uh, on customer needs. So the milk is uh, received, degasified, uh, slightly cooled and stored. The second section is uh, the fat melting section. Our customer asked us to be able to work with uh, standard butter blocks of 25 kilo or palm oil. So what we manufactured here is two different sections. So we have a storage tank of 10,000 liters for the, for the palm oil and the classical fat melter for the butter blocks. Our fat melter is uh, constructed so according uh, uh, latest standards. So we have the, the mixing, we have the grid, two different temperatures, and this part contributes to create uh, the final mixture with the adjustment of the fat title before the pasteurization. The mixture is stored inside these tanks and from these tanks we go to the pasteurization section. After the pasteurization we can move, uh, say more specifically, on the cheese making process. So we have two different steps. The first step is uh, the pasteurized milk that goes into three buffer tanks of 5,000 liters each where we had salt, uh, starting from salt powder. This is a sort of preparation phase before the final. The final part is uh, eight tanks, and I will explain why, where we have the final adding for uh, fermentation and GDL. Those tanks are peculiar. Each final filling section, and we can manage up to four filling sections in parallel, is served by two tanks. So one tank is for the fermentation and the other one is for the delivery of the solution to the filling unit. The process is, uh, say, quite peculiar because uh, we have to remember that we uh, are in hot filling. So the, the complete process is managed uh, using liquid form. Then the final solidification happens around 40, 45 minutes after the filling. It's very important as usual, to say that everything that you see here is exactly the same installation that you will see on the customer factory. The system is completely automatic, so we have a single electrical cabinet with single TLCs that talk one to each other and are able on a SCADA platform to work on a supervising system. To complete our description, uh, let me tell you that in the perspective of the turnkey supply, the complete equipment that you see here is served by a single unit with four tanks of 3,000 liter automatic CIP. The CIP system is able to clean and sanitize every part of the process. Uh, it's, it's managed completely in automatic uh, with an automatic station for the dosing of the detergent and with a complete and constant interconnection between all the parts uh, of the plant is a complete plant for the production of the feta cheese. The plant is automatic, and this is only one of the solutions that Frau is able to discuss with, with the customer. So please don't hesitate to contact us for any project, any ideas, or anything that we can discuss together. Let's get back to the next video.